Some new clues in the search for a killer. Good evening. I'm Matt Austin. And I'm Lisa Bell. The person who murdered Joshua Herr has been on the run for two weeks now. But tonight, police are putting out these pictures pictures of people they think could have key information about this murder investigation. It happened back on December 23rd outside Kim's Food Market. That's at West 3rd Street and South Poplar Avenue in Samford. News 6 reporter Sean Chayabat is there live tonight. And Sean, that community is still really shaken up by this. Yeah, Lisa, they are. Just take a look at this memorial right over here. You could tell how much neighbors here really loved this store owner. And police are banking on that. They are hoping that someone around here has the key to crack this case. Sanford police released these store security pictures of three people. They are not suspects, but may know something about what led up to Joshua Hur's death. Hur owned Kim's food store for the past year. In that time, he became a well liked and important part of the neighborhood. He's just the sweetest person. So I was astonished, baffled that that happened to him. The people in this neighborhood liked that store owner enough yes. that someone would come forward. Yes. Definitely, most definitely. Anybody that would know something would say something. Van Taylor heard the gunshots December 23rd, shortly after 7, when her normally closed for the night. About five gunshots, like simultaneously in a row. And I was sitting on the couch watching TV, didn't think nothing of it, because, like I said, happens in the neighborhood all the time. You don't know if it's fireworks, you don't know if it's something else, and you don't want to get involved. These pictures are the first big break in the case since the shooting two weeks ago. Neighbors hope these three people come forward and say the store's customers were almost all locals. Somebody knows who it oh, is. Oh, yeah, definitely. There's a lot of people are regulars that come in and out of that store. Post those pictures up. Yeah. If I was to see them walk by, I'd be the first one to call yeah. immediately. And remember, you can call your tip into Crime Line for a reward. Now, judging from the reaction that we got from neighbors, police might get the help that they need. A lot of people around here really want to see that shooter get caught. Lisa. All right, Sean Chai about reporting live in Sanford tonight. Thank you.